Alright, uh, what's up guys? This is Bo. Here we are. Another van build. So let me introduce you to... If we're gonna give the, the, the van a name. Oh, my mama called the Black Beauty. <laughs> no, no, no. I call it 2019. I, I, I like Black Beauty. Okay. So... We have to we get, we have we have, we have to start naming these van because we, I don't know which one's which. So this is uh, Chook the van. <laughs> <laughs> I like that one. Chook the van. So uh, what does Chook mean? Uh, it's uh, a Cambodian. It's it means a uh, lotus van. So uh, okay. I don't know what. So this Chook the van. <laughs> um, one forty. This is twenty nineteen. Uh, one forty. Uh, one seventy wheelbase 4x4 four four. okay you can see it sitting over 16 inches off uh, the ground it's very high current under uh, this is a crew van so you have a bench seat in the middle and um, both uh, glass uh, window on the setting and on the opposite side of it okay let's take a look at inside here all right we're gonna build this out completely you see it has the the headliner it's gonna come off okay it's gonna be something different this whole area will be packed with four lithium batteries and it's gonna have 400 uh, what solar panel it, it has a lot of ton ton of stuff so this is what you see right now and watch the after let's take a look at the uh, front really quick all right in the front uh, you got power seats you got uh, is this heated seat heated uh, yes heated seats okay and you got all the controls uh, reclining seats you got a um, five inch, uh, five by ten inch uh, touch screen, infotainment control. You got Wi-Fi in here, uh, keyless entry, push start button. So this van is loaded. That's it. Are you guys ready to build the van? Yes. yes. I got them yes. ready here. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ready to build the van. Okay. Let's do this. Take, 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 take. There. Wow. It's on a roll. Not, not, not a professional now. Why did that? Huh? And this thing, you just uh, use flat screwdriver, turn it sideways, and. I, I oh, Anita, you know screw driver look like, right then? Okay. Yeah. Like I'm this? I'm just kidding with you. Turn it. Pop it off it. See? Mm-hmm. Alright. First, we are applying the uh, sound deadening system. We are using the uh, this brand, Kiamat, it's 80 millimeter sound deadening system. Okay, you guys, this is hard work. This is Harder than I thought. No, I'm just kidding. Well, it's <laughs> it's uh, almost the end of the day. We did a lot of we made a lot of progress actually. We did the uh, the sound deadening and now the insulation. Now look how pretty it comes out, and we are 99% done with the insulation. But it's getting tired, yes. Hey, good job, everybody. Good job. Good teamwork, Ooh. everybody. Good teamwork. Yeah, Where's, team Anita. Where's my drink? Boba, 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 boba. 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 Oh. <laughs> okay. 
what we're doing here is we are going to install the flat line uh, roof rack. It's going to be longer than that one, of course, for the entire length of the roof. And it's very easy. Uh, that one's later. later. Uh, I need all the hardware. It's going to be all the hardware included. All right, you guys, this morning we installed this prime design ladder, 100% aluminum, no drilling. It looks so sporty right now. That's done. And let's go on the roof. Uh, we just cut the, the roof for the ceiling fan. We're gonna have two ceiling fans. One of them is cut right now. Okay. Right there, first hole has been cut. Now we're just priming uh, to make sure uh, this is the breast protection. And I forgot, we also in, uh, install the rack, okay? Uh, almost complete with the rack. We, uh, we just don't install the crossbar yet because um, uh, we wait until we finish the installing the fan so we can we know where the bar is going to be for the solar panel touch but otherwise yep really good progress look at the two fans so nice and then four solar panels gonna go in between we kind of play out we laid out where the uh, uh, best uh, spot for the solar panels uh, we want a solar panel on the back but it, it kind of don't work for us um, uh, this is like the best layout as far as the rooftop for us because the uh, with the four solar panels it will not uh, will not fit so all right stay tuned all right Chuk is getting four of these high quality premium uh, Renegy 100 watt solar panels making it 400 watts in total of uh, solar and um oh, for total 100 watts coming solar coming in uh these panels are very compact size um they are only 19 and a half by 22 and a half in size and this is how i mount i'm going to mount them so i'm using this kind of bracket they're gonna go this way with my stainless steel bolt here it's gonna be like this okay nuts and washer or stainless steel and then it's gonna go on the other side sitting on uh, the 8020 which is a cross beam like this it's gonna sit this way actually Okay, it's gonna sit on that and how we mount these onto the 8020 okay slide these hex nut into these slots here and then inside here okay, that two bolts for each one just like that okay it's going to sit so tight on these and it's going to be uh, sharing four on each uh, four brackets on 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 each um, bar and it's going to be super super strong these are uh, 8020 it's a uh, the double it's um uh, one by it's um one by uh two that comes with the uh our um uh rack on the top these are from flatline
Yikes. We have a little bit of compromise here with this, the the kind of uh, uh, setup that I have right now. Well, not this kind of layout, uh, but the, the bracket uh, setup. Uh, it's a little bit extended out on both sides, so on on all corners, it would extend out too a little bit too much. So it it hits it hits the uh, uh, the the rear fan a little bit, just a couple inches. So I have to come up come up with a different solution here. Um, I might have to redo these brackets in a different way so it doesn't extend out in order to uh, fit all four panels uh, up here and we do want to have four, four panels there is enough room uh, it can be done okay with that being said this episode ends right here uh, let me try to figure out uh, what to do next and I will see you uh, next episode thanks for watching everybody See you soon.